Hello guys and gals, welcome to one of the smartphones tutorial videos on the Samsung Galaxy S9. In this video I'll be showing you guys how to check to see if the S9 has been reported lost or stolen. Uh, so if you are buying a device online, I str strongly recommend doing this. Um, if you guys find this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you know somebody looking for this information, be sure to share it with them. So if you're buying a, a used device of any kind, I strongly recommend checking to see if it's been reported lost or stolen. I highly recommend meeting up with the at a carrier store and making sure the device has been paid off completely. That way you're not stuck with a device that has not been paid off or has been reported lost or stolen. So um, if you're buying online, strongly recommend doing it. Um, if you guys, if I always ask, hey, can I get the IMEI number? I check it myself. Um, if you, you know, if you're talking to somebody, they don't know where it's at, you can always share this video with them. I will be showing you guys the first part of this video, showing you guys where to find it. And the second part is how to check it. So what we're going to want to do to start off is go into settings right up here at the top right hand corner. As you pull down in the little shortcut menu, there will be that little gear looking thing. Go ahead, tap that. From here, it takes you to your settings page. From settings, scroll down till you see about phone. Once you're down there, go ahead and select that. And from here, we're going to go to status. Go ahead, select that. And the second one down is the IMEI information. So go ahead, select that. And from here, we have the IMEI right there. So that is how to locate the IMEI. If somebody is looking for it, that's how to find it. So the next thing we're going to want to do is go ahead and grab a device. Um, whatever you're using and I always just you can google freeesncheck.com and from there you can find the free ESN or Swappa is another reputable site that also does the checking for you and in this one um, you go ahead and you select which carrier you are using um, this is a Verizon phone so I'm going to select that type in the IMEI number that's the exact same number that we find right in here on the IMEI slot once you have it typed in just go ahead and hit submit it may take a little uh, take a second or two to run their test to kind of check it to make sure that everything is good. So it should come up with a passed, a failed, or if it says anything besides passed, I strongly recommend um, calling the provider or meeting up at the with the provider. If you're buying online, um, I strongly recommend calling them and saying, hey, I just ran, ran a test on this IMEI and it comes back as invalid or whatever else. Can you guys let me know what's going on with this? Uh, with the with this uh, device before you buy it. So um, as we can see this one says pass on both of them So that means that this device is good um, Samsung Galaxy S9 64 gigabyte and coral blue. That's what I have and they have passed So that's how to check the IMEI on a Samsung Galaxy S9 or to find the IMEI number So once again, if you're buying this in person, I strongly recommend just pulling up that that screen checking it online real quick just making sure you're kind of covering yourself also strongly recommend meeting up at a place let's say if it's a verizon phone meet up at a verizon store um have them check everything out make sure everything else is working from the verizon end so that's all i got for you guys in this video if you guys like to see other helpful tips and tricks on the samsung galaxy s9 go ahead and check out that playlist in the description below thank you guys for watching have a nice day